Hello there guys, my name is Ken Shadlog, Stubborn, but built for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park Newsroom update where today we're going to be looking at some construction taking place for the brand new coaster coming to Park du Bacasse in 2021. Now before we get started, make sure you go and check out the, fi the final day today of the poll. Uh, where I'll be reacting to your responses this weekend. Obviously you'll know what the poll is if you've seen it. If you haven't, go to the community page. I shared it recently, uh, a couple of days after it uploaded. So I wanted to get you guys to keep voting. And um, you know, get you know, just keep voting guys. Keep getting your comments down below as well. Um, keep getting your comments below the poll uh, for extra comments that I'm going to react to as well. Give yourself a shout out as well. And we did a poll before that about the next one of the next five years videos that has been decided both of them are going to be pre-recorded well what the first one will be pre-recorded first and then the next one and uh, both of them will be ready and able for next week hopefully so stay tuned for all of that but for now guys make sure you like comment subscribe click the notification bell so you never miss another youtube video and for now let's get straight into this so of course park du Bacasse. now this is a park in europe it's a smaller amusement park and we knew something was coming because we did a video on some footers that were spotted and we sort of said, well, what's it going to be? What's it going to be? Well, from the track from Vacoma and the post they put out on social media, we now know what is coming. It is a Vacoma suspended family coaster. So let's have a look at the Vacoma images and share to you guys what's been happening. So Park du Bacasse will be investing in a clone of Orkanen at Faroup Summerland, which is a 453 meter model of the Vacoma suspended family coaster. And this is the same model as the other types of coasters, such as the Galaxy Express at two parks over in Asia. We also had the Dragon Roller Coaster at Energylandia and Dragonflyer at Dollywood. But the original, the, the original, um, version of this model was of course Orkney at Far Up Summerland. Now this has a length of 1,486.3 feet, a height of 63.3 feet, a speed of 46.6 miles per hour, and a G-force of 3.5. So as you can see by the Google Earth image on your screen right now, it is located opposite the Dino Burger and some other attractions as well. So it's a big grass area right near to the entrance of the theme park. And this is going to be more than enough of an area after seeing a Discord image which showed the Dragonfly coaster from Dollywood cropped into the area and you could see that it would fit. Now you can go and check that out. I'm sure it's online somewhere and it's on the Coaster Force forum so I'd recommend you go and check that forum out uh, to have a look at it on the construction thread. But uh, you could see on there that the Orkin, uh, the Dragonfly, which is the same layout as Orkin and is actually... Uh, fitted straight in there perfectly into that area so it's very exciting the fact that um, this is going to fit in this park and I think this is a great investment for the theme park as well and I think that um, they've done a really good job in trying to tease this coaster as well. So there we go, let's look at the construction of Park du Bacasse um, and looking at what's been happening, you can see the two images from Vacoma of track ready to be delivered from the factory straight to the park and uh, you saw a Google Earth image as well uh, talking about this potential, well not even potential now, it's this confirmed coaster uh, of what the confirmed layout is and also where it's going to be located in the park as well and it's good that they're going to be building something right near the entrance of the theme park and I like how the area right next to it is sort of close to the road I guess because obviously you can see the, the little bit over there and you know I think that the the area of the the part that they put this in is actually really clever it's nice to have a mainstream signature right at the front of the park so uh, I mean I'm going to be a big fan of this once this opens but I hope you guys are going to be a big fan of this as well so thank you very much guys for watching this update it's not the biggest update in the world just to confirm what the coaster is uh, we know it's opening in 2021 I mean in terms of theming I mean this is going to have a dinosaur theme in my opinion I think with it being opposite the, the Dino Burger um, sort of place and a couple of attractions as well themed to the Jurassic period we're looking at a dino theme here uh, we have heard reports rumouredly from sources that the theming could be quite good so uh, I'm expecting some Flight of the Pterosaur type theming maybe um, you'll have to see what, what kind of name they go for for this ride so again it's going to be a nice underrated investment for European parks and Park du Bacassi are going to do an incredible job with this coaster so thank you very much guys for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more. And for now, my name is Coast Shell, Kill in the Coast of Life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care guys. Have an awesome day.